Hello! In this video I'll show you how to make 22.2 of nominal voltage and 6 amp hours of capacity battery pack by using any 650 lithium cells removed from dead laptop batteries. How to get and inspect any 650 cells you will check by clicking in my other DIY video. Link is in bottom right corner. I took 18 cells with biggest capacity at the current moment I had. My plan is to get 22.2 of nominal voltage battery pack. I made a sum of all 18 cells capacity and divided by 6. It's the capacity of each of 6 in series connected cells group. I'll connect them in 6S3P schema. It means that 3 cells will be connected in one parallel group and all 6 groups will be connected in series. Arrange it all 18 cells in 6 groups that each group will have as close as possible 6000 mAh of capacity. This is the structure and wiring pattern how finished battery pack should look like. You have specific size and shape regarding of purpose where it will be used. It will power up my homemade 100 watts LED flashlight. DIY flashlight video link is in corner. With double sided tape glue it grouped cells in block soft free. This tape holds very well. After that started to glue them in final structure regarding my design template. Again use the same double sided tape. In battery pack center attach small plastic tube, which is exact in same dimensions as 18650 cells. I have to do that because my design structure was from 19 pieces, but regarding desirable voltage I have to use 18 cells. Applied some flux and pretending connection points. For wiring, I use nickel stripe pieces, which was removed from disassembled laptop batteries. Solder them regarding prepared template.
both sides will solder it. All individual cells was fully charged before assembling in this battery pack. So they should give us 25.2 volts. Nice! Nominal voltage is 3.7 volts multiplied by 6. So it is 22.2 volts. Prepared and soldered power wires. To make connection points, I use T plug connectors. There is plenty of them on eBay. Next, attach balance wires. Because my battery pack is from 6 pieces connected in series, so I need to balance them. Wiring schema is very simple. It is neat to connect a wire at positive and negative battery terminals and between each group of cells connected in series. Only in this way I'll be able to charge each cell group connected in series at the same voltage. Let's check it, does everything was soldered at the right place? If I did it right, I should get 4.2 volts at first pin and at other pins voltage must increase by 4.2 volts at each. Well done! Now it's need to protect all wiring and open terminals. For that, I'll use some transparent plastic sheet that left from all tools package. With double-sided tape attach it in place and marked outline. Cut it and bend it to get proper cover shape. That's how covers looks finished. With electric tape fix it covers in place. And that's it, battery pack is finished. I made a discharge test to find a real battery pack capacity. And it is the same as I calculated before assembling. It is 6 amp hours. To get brand new battery with those packs, it will cost you 50 bucks at least. My cost for this battery pack is under few bucks. And all that is for connectors and wires. If you like what you saw and want to see more, Check my channel and other videos. Don't forget to subscribe for future projects. Thanks for watching.